Hello, good morning everyone. Today I would like to uh, continue teach you on the property that is a linearity property of the Laplace transform, which is in example 4.4b. So given that the Euler formula exponent j theta equal to cos theta plus j sine theta, then show that the Laplace transform of the cos theta uh, cos a t is equal to the s over s squared plus a squared and Laplace transform of the sine a t is equal to the a over s squared plus a squared. Okay, uh, first of all, how to do? You have the Laplace transform of the exponential, right? Because based on the Euler formula. So Laplace transform of the exponent j a t is equal to the Laplace transform of the cos a t plus the j Laplace transform of the sine a t. Okay, this is from the Euler formula. And then, and then from the Laplace transform of the S1 J A T, what do you get? Okay, then from table, okay, from table, you go to find the exponent A T. Okay, let's go to the formula. Exponent a t is equal to 1 over s minus a. Okay, so your a is referred to the j a in this case. So 1 over uh, s minus j a is equivalent to exponent a t. But how do you, okay, for the sign, if you look at the question, sign or cos is a squared plus a squared. It's from here, means that you have to multiply s minus a multiply with the s plus a okay in order to get s squared plus a squared all right so here you get time with the s plus j a s minus s plus j a if you cancel out you will get one also okay so when you multiply these two you will get s plus j a s squared minus j square a square so j square you get negative 1 so you will get s square plus a square okay if you separate it you will get s over s square plus a square plus j a over a squared plus a squared so this is the okay so I assume this one I assume this one is the equation 1 and this one is the equation 2 so I compare the 1 and the 2 so Laplace transform of the cos a t is equivalent to what? Laplace transform of the a t is equal to the s over s squared plus a squared. Whereas the j Laplace transform of the sine a t. So Laplace transform of the sine a t is equivalent to the a a squared plus a squared so in this case actually you have proof that this is uh, you have a proof the Laplace transform of the cos is equal to the s over a squared plus a squared whereas the Laplace transform of the sine is equal to the a over a squared a squared plus a squared okay hope you can understand and thank you for watching and see you on next class for the shifting properties Alright, bye.